And lastly, let's go look at the About tab. Okay, this tab is purely informational. There's nothing here you can change. There's nothing here you can set. Uh, it gives you the device name that's set, Ford, its IP address. There's a hardware version that it reads off the gateway, the application version of the software loaded, what the model name is, the manufacturer, electronic theater controls, and the default gateway name. It figures this out on its own, and what it's made up of is ETC, the manufacturer, Net3, gateway, four port, and then these last bits here are the last three octets of its MAC address. The TFT file name is the name of the file that it's going to request from the TFTP server. So when on your computer, if you go into typically C E T C nodes bin, in there will be a file gwinst.bin, and that's the file that this gateway is going to ask for. Down here we have the four ports type of modules that's installed. In this case I have a, a four out DMX gateway and it shows XLR female for every one of those. If I had an, a male it would show that for an input or uh, there's an other which is an RJ45 and there's a terminal strip. Down here we have the SID again and the DSID. The DSID is the device type so this does this is the same between different four port gateways it's different to a two port gateway so here's all the information on the about tab and uh, on to the next gateway type